Imagine you're in Banff, surrounded by the beautiful landscape of mountains and lakes. While you're there, you would probably want to use your phone to take a picture. Many of you have experienced taking a picture in panoramic mode. I could relate this to my research. To capture the picture of that beautiful landscape, consider we need a phone. Similarly, to capture the picture of our heart, we need a medical scanning technique called ultrasound imaging. There are many other scanning techniques like X-ray, MRI, CT, etc. But ultrasound is considered one of the best because it is readily available, portable, less expensive and does not impose any harmful radiations. You could see a similar type of screen as in the top picture in most of our phones to take a panoramic view. We usually follow that arrow by moving our phone to slightly different positions. Likewise here, the ultrasound probe is moved to different positions around the heart to capture the heart structures from different angles and are saved as three-dimensional videos. An example of 3D video frame of heart is in the bottom picture in black and white color. In our project particularly, this ultrasound scanning is done by a robotic arm. Once you finish taking the picture in the panoramic mode, there is a software running behind it which will align all the images that were taken by moving our phone to different positions so that it can be smoothly joined to give a nice picture of that landscape in a wide view. Here my research is to align these three-dimensional videos of heart using an optical tracking software and a process called image registration. After that, I will fuse it one over another using artificial intelligence methods, which involves neural networks that are trained using these three-dimensional videos so that the network can learn appropriate features from them and do a smooth fusion on the new data. The research shows that one in four Canadians are affected with heart disease. The biggest challenge here is the correct identification of the disease and better treatment. This image fusion would obtain a large amount of information from different views, hence increase the quality of ultrasound image. My research outcome on this image fusion would be a significant tool for the clinicians to assess the heart structures in detail by combining different views, ensuring no information is missed. This will enable accurate diagnosis for various heart diseases. In addition, ultrasound imaging is time and energy efficient so that long wait time of the patients can be reduced which in turn reduce their stress and anxiety. Let's go for a better future by fusing artificial intelligence with ultrasound imaging. Thank you.